Hello everyone welcome back to another video, so guys today in this video we will discuss on, latest spoofing file for your android phones, guys, I have already posted a video, using this method, if you remember, iPhone 16 Pro Max spoofing file, this video is also based on same method, but this time, I have bought another gaming phone spoofing file, and the file name is, ROG9 Performance. Yes guys this is ROG9 gaming spoofing file, this will change your Android system, to ROG9, and Snapdragon 8 Elite, guys this file will work in all Android phones, even if you rooted or non-rooted phones, and I will show you the application process in both rooted and non-rooted phones. But this time don't expect so much in non-rooted phone, because there are some limitations to boost non-root phones, but yes if you have rooted phones, and, thinking, to use this file, then you should definitely use this file, this may also unlock max FPS and graphics in some games, and also rooted phones users can see the change details in, dev check application, but non-rooted users cannot see in dev check application. But it will be changed in your Android database, but don't worry, it would be changed to ROG9. Ok guys now let's move on to applying process, please watch full video to avoid any mistakes, so guys without wasting more time, let's get start the video. Ok guys first you need to download the file, from the given link, name is Esus ROG9 spoof file, from the given link, well I have downloaded in both the phone, because I will flash the file in both the phone, to show you that, this file fully working in, rooted and non-rooted phones, so this is my Samsung phone which is rooted, and has custom ROM installed, for now let's keep it inside, first I will show you by flashing in non-rooted phone, so guys please watch video carefully. If your phone is also non-rooted, and want to use this in, your phone, now what you need to do is, go to downloaded folder. And here you can see, two folder has been provided inside the file, first one is for rooted phones, and second one is for non-rooted phones, so select and flash according to your phone status, in this phone I'm going to use non-root file, next if you want to check the script file, whether it's legit or not, then open the SS ROG file, and here you will see, for files has been provided, now simply open fake ROG.sh file, using with any text editor, here I'm using MT manager to open file. Guys here if you see closely, let me focus first, ok you can see here, that all the script is based of SS ROG9, these scripts will change your Android system, and spoof Android into ROG9 gaming phone. If you slide down a little bit, here also added ROG9, chipset and model name, which is Snapdragon 8 Elite, so guys overall all the info has been added of ROG9, and also added gaming and performance script to boost your gaming performance, now let's try to flash this file in this phone. Next what you need to do is, just go back, and here copy SS ROG folder, then paste it in internal storage. After pasting make sure folder has been pasted successfully, now again open the pasted folder. Then here open, command and features file, guys here all the command has been provided, which you can copy and execute in prevent application, so first let's copy install command. After copy the install command, open prevent application, then activate it with wireless debugging, or PC, then go execute command section, and here simply paste and execute the copied command, guys the files has been started to flash, it may take few seconds to complete, so please wait to complete. Ok guys the file has been flashed successfully, your phone has been spoof, but you cannot see in dev check application. So we will check in database with the help of executable command, to get the command, again go back. To the downloaded folder, then copy check info command. After copy again go to prevent application, and here paste and execute the command, so guys now your spoofing detail will show, in your phone database, here you can see that, your phone is now, ROG9, and also chipset has changed into Snapdragon 8 Elite, so guys this is the way to spoof your Android database in non-rooted phones, which you can use, to boost your gaming performance, and as I already told you, that, the non-root process, will not show the changed Android name and chipset in dev check application, but if your phone is rooted, then you can easily see the changed in dev check application, but don't worry guys the file has been applied done, and it ready to perform on your phone.
Now I'm going to show you by flashing in rooted phones, that how this will change any Android phone into ROG9 with just a simply trick, so if your phone is rooted then, open Magisk Manager, then go to Module section, then tap in this plus icon, and it will be redirect to the internal storage, from where you have to locate the Magisk module, so this is the file for rooted phones, guys here for Magisk module has been provided. Let me explain which one should you flash, so at the top you can see the Magisk module, which boot loop fix module, which you should definitely flash to avoid any boot loop error. So let's flash this module first, to flash the module simply tap the file, and the flashing process will be start automatically. Ok guys the boot loop fix module has been flashed successfully, now go back to the folder, guys here you can see, there are two modules has been provided, for MediaTek and Snapdragon processor, if your phone is MediaTek based then you must flash MediaTek version, and if your phone is Snapdragon, Exynos and other processor, then you can flash Snapdragon version, my phone's processor is also Exynos, and I'm going to flash the Snapdragon version, so let's flash this module. Guys all the modules has been flashed, now we need to restart our phone to change, but before restarting phone, let me show you the device specifications in dev check application, guys you can easily download this app from play store, and here you can see that it's showing the real specifications of my phone, which is Samsung Exynos 7870, but after restart, it will be changed to ROG 9 and Snapdragon 8 Elite, so let's restart the phone. Guys the phone has been restarted, first let's open Magisk Manager to check whether the module has been flashed or not, and you can see here that the module has been flashed done, now let's open dev check application. Guys right now it's still showing the real specifications of my phone even after restart the phone. But don't worry, here we have to do one more steps to get the Snapdragon 8 Elite, so follow this steps, first go to app info of dev check application, then here clear all the data, after clearing the data, relaunch the app, and boom, guys here you can, my phone has been changed into Snapdragon 8 Elite, with SS ROG 9 specifications, now this spoofing will help to unlock max FPS and graphics in any games, also help to fix gaming lag more than 90% if your phone is rooted then. You can see these changes, but in non-rooted phone it will work around 60%, but it's confirmed that, this file suitable for both the phones, rooted and non-rooted, so guys this was the method to change your normal Android into S's ROG9 gaming phone. If you also want to change, then simply download the file, and follow the steps according to your phone status, root or non-root method, and see the magic of these file, all the links are provided in videos pinned comment, or in my telegram channel, and if you want to get direct link of these files, then you can join my channel membership, in an affordable price, lots of subscribers are getting benefits of channel membership, joining link is provided in description box, guys I hope you like this video, and if my videos are informative, then kindly, like share and subscribe for more amazing videos, so guys that's all for today, see you in next video, till then take care and sign out.